The old saying goes it takes two to tango, but today in Columbia, several people were welcomed into the rhythm. News 19's Peyton Lewis has more. Throughout the weekend in West Columbia, Dragon Productions has been hosting people with a passion for classic tango. Kayla Marie and Jonathan Baez are dance instructors who work with Dragon Productions, and they say they're happy to share this style of dance with the Midlands community. The people that you meet in this dance, it's amazing because it's a, it's a global community. So people all over the world, all different backgrounds, all different perspectives. But in that moment, when you're together in the embrace, it's just you guys. It's your own little world that you get to make. In Metal Your Culture, the only word is dancing. So <laughs> you can meet people every, all around the world. And thanks to Tango, Deanna and Don Rosenberg both found their forever dance partner. You're choreographing a dance in real time. You have no idea what it's going to turn out to be until, you know, until you're in the middle of it. And the That's follower... That's what's exciting. Yeah. And from sunup until sundown, dancers from across the state, nation, and world came together for a marathon of milonga. Dancers started getting into their rhythm around 2 in the afternoon Saturday and will continue dancing until 2 a.m. Sunday morning. In Argentina, normally milonga start like 10 or 11 o'clock in the night, yeah. and until 6, 5, 4, depends. It's amazing, but it's a style of life. Reporting in West Columbia, Peyton Lewis, News 19, WLTX. Well, if you want to join in on that fun, maybe learn some dance moves, the next Tango event will be on the Southeast, will be the Southeast, rather, Tango Festival in Charlotte. That's going to be starting October 13th.